6061 is a precipitation hardening aluminium alloy, containing magnesium and silicon as its major alloying elements. Originally called alloy 61S, it was developed in 1935. It has good mechanical properties and exhibits good weldability. It is one of the most common alloys of aluminium for general purpose use. It is commonly available in pre-tempered grades such as 6061O and tempered grades such as 6061T6 and 6061T651. Basic Properties 6061 has a density of 2.70 g mar cubed. Chemical Composition The alloy composition of 6061 is silicon minimum 0.4%, maximum 0.8% by weight, iron no minimum, maximum 0.7%. Copper minimum 0.15%, maximum 0.40%, manganese no minimum, maximum 0.15%, magnesium minimum 0.8%, maximum 1.2%, chromium minimum 0.04%, maximum 0.35%, zinc no minimum, maximum 0.25%, titanium no minimum, maximum 0.15%. Other elements no more than 0.05% each, 0.15% total, remainder aluminium, mechanical properties, the mechanical properties of 6061 depend greatly on the temper, or heat treatment, of the material. Young's modulus is 10A, 106 psi regardless of temper. 6061O, annealed 6061 has maximum tensile strength no more than 18,000 psi and maximum yield strength no more than 8,000 psi. The material has elongation of 25 a euro 30 percent. 6061T4, T4 temper 6061 has an ultimate tensile strength of at least 30,000 psi and yield strength of at least 16,000 psi. It has elongation of 16 percent. 6061T6, T6 temper 6061 has an ultimate tensile strength of at least 42,000 psi and yield strength of at least 35,000 psi. More typical values are 45,000 psi and 40,000 psi, respectively. In thicknesses of 0.250 inch or less, it has elongation of 8% or more. In thicker sections, it has elongation of 10%. T651 temper has similar mechanical properties. The typical value for thermal conductivity for 6061T6 at 77 a degree Fahrenheit is around 152 watts per meter Ka material data sheet defines the fatigue limit under cyclic load as 14,000 psi for 500 million completely reversed cycles using a standard or a more test machine and specimen. Note that aluminum does not exhibit a well-defined knee on its SN graph, so there is some debate as to how many cycles equates to infinite life. Also note the actual value of fatigue limit for an application can be dramatically affected by the conventional derating factors of loading, gradient, and surface finish. Uses, 6061 is commonly used for the following, construction of aircraft structures, such as wings and fuselages, more commonly in home-built aircraft than commercial or military aircraft. 2024 alloy is somewhat stronger. But 6061 is more easily worked and remains resistant to corrosion even when the surface is abraded, which is not the case for 2024, which is usually used with a thin alclad coating for corrosion resistance. Yacht construction, including small utility boats. Automotive parts, such as wheel spacers. The manufacture of aluminium cans for the packaging of foodstuffs and beverages. Scuba tanks. 6061T6 is used for the construction of bicycle frames and components. Many fly fishing reels. The famous Pioneer plaque was made of this particular alloy. The secondary chambers and baffle systems in firearm sound suppressors, while the primary expansion chambers usually require 17 4 pH or 303 stainless steel or titanium. The upper and lower receivers of many AR 15 variants. Many aluminum docks and gangways are constructed with 6061T6 extrusions, and welded into place. Material used in some ultra-high vacuum chambers, welding, 6061 is highly weldable, for example using tungsten inert gas welding or metal inert gas welding. Typically, after welding, 
the properties near the weld are those of 60610, a loss of strength of around 80%. The material can be reheat treated to restore T4 or T6 temper for the whole piece. After welding, the material can naturally age and restore some of his strength as well. Nevertheless, the Alco Structural Handbook recommends the design strength of the material adjacent to the weld to be taken as 11,000 psi without proper heat treatment after the weld. Typical filler material is 4043 or 5356. Extrusions 6061 is an alloy used in the production of extrusions a euro long constant a euro cross section structural shapes produced by pushing metal through a shaped die. Forgings 6061 is an alloy that is suitable for hot forging. The billet is heated through an induction furnace and forged using a closed die process. Automotive parts, ATV parts, and industrial parts are just some of the uses as a forging. References Further reading, Properties of Wrought Aluminum and Aluminum Alloys, 6061 Alclad 6061, Properties and Selection, Non-Ferrous Alloys and Special Purpose Materials, Vol. 2, ASM Handbook, ASM International, 1990, pages 102 to 103.